hi guys welcome back so I am back again with a makeup look for prom this is like purple and teal halo eyes with peach nude lips so you want to see how I created this look then please keep on watching I first applied max soft ochre paint pot all over my eyelid as a base and applied translucent powder on top of it to set it in then I decided to give my eyeshadows a black base because that makes your uh, colors appear more vibrant. So taking a flat eyeshadow brush, I picked up MAC Black Track Gel Eyeliner and applied it first closer to my lash line. And then whatever that was left on my brush, I applied it near to my crease as in I am going above as you can see with very little product left on my brush so that I don't end up looking like a panda and I can you know uh, blend it out later on in my crease so picking up this peachy brown transition color from modern matte palette by BH Cosmetics I am applying it as a transition color and blending the uh, black liner Yeah. now from the same palette I picked up this purple eyeshadow onto a damp eyeshadow brush and applied it in the inner and the outer corner of my eye and in the inner corner I'm still leaving the tear duct area blank because there the different color is gonna go in there now I applied this a little lighter purple eyeshadow from the same palette just to you know give a little more pop to the purple eyeshadow now taking a clean blending brush with no product on it at all as I said clean yeah I'm just blending out my crease as in the colors in my crease and blending out all the harsh lines now using BH Cosmetics fall eyes eyeshadow palette I picked up this teal eyeshadow and applied it in the centers of my eyes and as you can see I'm working my way little by little and I am applying it and then slightly blending it out then applying a little more of it and then which which is there on my brush and as you can see I just don't like the idea of it being there just sitting there so I am blending out the corners uh, of the teal eyeshadow with the purple the same teal eyeshadow is now going in my tear duct area this is gonna brighten up the whole eye makeup and taking a makeup wipe I then cleared all the fallout I'm now applying this nude uh, matte eyeshadow on my brow bone and taking Deborah Milano 24 or ore or whatever you call it it's a pen eyeliner I'm applying a simple cat eye and then to make it further more black and intense I applied Maybelline hyper matte liquid eyeliner on top of it tight lining my eyes using plum everyday wear kajal and L'Oreal 4D lash architect mascara on my lashes I did apply four lashes off camera and then yes I applied foundation off camera and now I'm just highlighting my face using Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. You guys know this is my favorite. Now picking up the darkest shade from Sleek Makeup Contouring Palette. I am contouring my face as I normally do. You guys know the drill. You've seen me contouring a lot of times. So after filling in my brows, I went back to my lower lash line and I started smoking it out using the same purple eyeshadow that I had applied on my lid. But then it clicked me that I should have filled in my waterline and then should have tried smoking out my lower lash line. So I filled in my waterline using the same gel eyeliner by Plum and then went back and smoked out my lower lash line further. Now picking up the teal eyeshadow from the BH Cosmetics Foil Eyes, the same eyeshadow that is on my upper lid in the centers, is going on the lower lash line in the centers as well. Loads and loads of mascara on my lower lashes. And blush by NYX in shade Apricot on the apples of my cheeks. 
I then highlighted my face using Sleek Makeup Highlighting Palette in Solstice. This is like the favorite part of mine of the whole makeup thing. I just love highlighting my face. I can just pack it on, pack it on. For my lips, I picked up Gerard Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Aphrodite and applied it on my lips, the source. Yeah. And then MAC Fix Plus all over my face to get that dewy finish. And of course, you want that makeup to last all night. So yes, that completes the look, guys. I just love the way it turned out. I hope you people liked it too. And if you did, then don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.